Like, come on, why can't I find ammo for that? Seriously. I can't believe that this would, like... Yeah, and look, those things are, like, up there, and, like, it's impossible to hit them. Like, why, can't, why isn't there a lock-on button? Seriously, why? And look, my health is running low already. Where is that coming from? Oh, and suddenly those purple things start giving you virus. I've never seen that before. Oh, and guess what? I die from that stupid virus infection again, and I have to start the whole stupid level over again. And I've already, like, made it to, like, level 12 and uh, out of 13 in the ruined stage of Sector 2. This is only Sector 2. How many sectors are there? I mean, I know, like, each sector is, like, <laughs> 50 levels, but... Still, how many sectors are there? I hope there's not a lot, because this is, like, so far this game's been crap. Like, God, it's this dumb part of the game. You know what, I'm just going to run through this. There's not a gatekeeper in this room anyway, so I might as well just skip it. Going down the extremely long elevator ride. Oh, and guess what? I walk over the same thing again, except this time it doesn't give me a virus. Then when I'm low on health, where it would really be a bad thing, it suddenly starts... When did have you played a game where the general rules change based on how high or low your health is? Unable to code lightning, BLT. That's because that weapon sucks and I never use it because, well, it sucks. Seriously, that weapon's a piece of crap. Like, it fires like a continuous stream of, like electricity but almost but there's like no enemies that are like affected by that in any stage oh god I have to kill one of those stupid things like this is the worst part of the game it's so hard to make your targets from far away hopefully that was the last one nope I gotta kill that guy I think yeah and I, it's so hard to make your targets from that far away it, I may, it may look easy, but it's not. Oh, and guess what? I have to go and find the gatekeeper. Because I didn't see him, like... So now i got to backtrack through the whole level to find him. <clears throat> and you got to keep watch on your ammo. Like, even for the pistol, you got to watch your ammo. Like... Because, like, there's... And I'm running out of ammo for this, and this isn't even that good of a weapon because it takes so long to reload. And I'm even running out of ammo for this because it's all I got. Like, like they give you, like, mostly ammo for the suckish weapons. I mean, this game really should just have a common ammo indicator, and then, like, certain weapons use more energy than the others. That would be great, because then it, then it wouldn't be really much of a problem to find ammo for anything. Oh, I just died again. I had 50% health and I get killed in like 3 seconds. Only now I know where the gatekeeper is so I can confront him immediately. And the problem is, like... Again, I sound like a broken record, but even making it to the end of the level doesn't replenish your health. Which means, you have to go scour the entire level to find health packs. And if you start the next level with really, really low health, you're kind of screwed unless you can find more health, because, like, it's almost impossible to confront an enemy without getting yourself hit. And, like, sometimes they just wait for you at the door, and then they immediately attack you before you can possibly react. 
And there's finally a health pack, a rare sight in this game, I must say. Seriously, man. Overall, I give this game a 2 out of 5. I mean, I like first-person shooters, but this game stinks. I mean, think about it. You have, like, super hyper-limited ammo, even for the weaker weapons. And, like... Like, it's hard to find health packs. And that really sucks, especially because, like, even getting to the end of the level doesn't, uh doesn't replenish your health and also once you die you start the whole friggin level over again you have to like backtrack and like and also you have to like uh... like you have to find all these gatekeepers and kill them all and if you haven't found them you make it to the end of the level oh the end of the level is locked you have to backtrack to the whole level to find them at which point you usually get killed because you've like like try to get through the whole level and I would trade this game in but these stupid things have lower resale value than Game Boy Color games you get like a dollar twenty five for a PSP game I am dead serious I got like three bucks out of two games that I turned in